Welcome back to our Made in Tennessee Viewer's Choice Countdown. Now throughout the whole month of May, we have been counting down your favorite Made in Tennessee stories that you voted on during the month of April. Now today we have reached number one on our countdown. So we'll be heading back to Paris, Tennessee and take a visit with the creators of the Foot Bar Walker for the, for the Viewer's Choice number one Made in Tennessee story. So let's take a look. What was once an old tile store in Paris? now houses G-A-N-M LLC. The company was started a few years ago by Gary and Nancy Morris to help patent and sell their creation, the foot bar walker. Uh, it is attachments that go on a standard walker that turns it into a assistance to not only the patient, but the caregiver. Gary and Nancy came up with the idea for the foot bar walker to help some close friends who were looking for a better way to get around. The walker works by allowing a caregiver to use their weight as a counterbalance to allow the person using the walker to pull themselves up with minimal strain. It worked for them very, very well, and at their encouragement and other people that we helped, we started for the patent. All the attachments that go into making the foot bar walker are made by a few different companies throughout Tennessee. Those attachments are then assembled by GANM LLC in the back of their shop. The company received the patent for the foot bar walker in 2017, and their simple invention has already started to make an impact in care centers across West Tennessee. One resident in particular used to have to use a lift to get out of the bed, and we put him in physical therapy using the foot bar walker, and now he no longer has to use the lift, and he's able to use this to get in and out of the bed. As far as the future for Gary, Nancy, and the foot bar walker, it's really a day-by-day -day process. There are regulations, and we're trying to abide by everything that, that we come along, that comes along that we say, hey, we need to do this, we need to do this, and it's a, it's a learning process. In Paris, for 39 News, I'm Jackson Overstreet.